hello welcome back welcome back to the channel no i've always wanted to do that i've always wanted to do a voice uh on leave or light welcome back we are going to do your person's feelings part one and part two let's get into it on um, the split is king of pentacles two of wands dissection i hear dissection it's almost like someone is examining a situation very closely there could be an older father in this situation. I feel like you were already talking to somebody, Libras, and I'm going to sweat a lot. I sweat a lot right here and on my neck, so you're going to see it a lot. Two of Wands waiting on you. Let's get it. 78 cards of Mermaid Tarot. Looks like this from the back. If you would like purchase, your girl got her nails retouched. <laughs> Welcome back to the channel. It's been a pleasure serving you these last three and a half years. It's been an incredible, I find it to be a responsibility to be able to read for a collective that ascends together. I'm going to get choked up about it because I thought about it uh, earlier today about how many have grown on just this channel alone. I get verklempt thinking about it. I really do because most of you have created a whole new life and I'm very, very proud of you. The feelings, please. And I will wait. Knight of Pentacles, the slowest moving knight. It's depicted with a girl in this particular tarot deck. As you guys know, genders, they, there's no response in tarot. It's just the energy. This person's very, very slow and you're tired of it. Okay, I'm getting that you're very, very tired of it. Queen of Cups could be dealing with a Cancer, Cancer Sun sign, Cancer Moon sign, Cancer Rising. So the six of pentacles someone wishes like you're their biggest regret they wish they would have spent more time with you they wish they would have invested in given also the giver like i'm being even shown the book with my visions here if you guys have ever read the giver um it's a semi-spiritual book i would say look into it but i was shown the book when i pulled up the six of pentacles to the judgment card yeah judgment seven of cups this person's priorities i feel third party with the seven of cups it's over here in the grotto this person had options i'm picking up if you're watching tonight and you had receipts of someone having options it's even showing up that you know there's a part of them that betrayed ten of swords it's like definitely coming up as cancer cancer's all over this reading in two spots queen of cups and the chariot i'm gonna put that here on my whiteboard and then we have the eight of wands okay they love to connect with you but i also feel here for some of you there's a family member or there's people like there's almost a group that watches you even maybe a karmic couple for some of you um there could be a jealous karmic couple that you know about as well Let's get into it. Why is it the Eight of Wands? Let's do the Eight of Wands and the Seven of Cups. That's variety for either one of you. Uh, I knew it. Three of Pentacles. I knew it was going to be a smaller Pentacles card. We have a Taurus now, Virgo, and Capricorn added to your reading. <clears throat> this person could have liked to go out dancing with you. Or there's something about like, maybe what I'm seeing is a pool hall. Like it's a kind of a darkened place to go hang out, but it's what I'm seeing is you had fun. So I don't know if there was a place here where you had fun. And also these lily pads remind me of pool too. So I feel like you have a different crowd now, Libra, that you hang out with. These people that you're with are high vibrational, if you will, <laughs> okay? You deserve to be five of cups. This person's going through something. This person could have some type of animal, maybe a cat they take care of at home or they have a dog, but they see you as their lighthouse. If you look in the background, he's not paying attention to it in this photo, but I believe at one time you were this person's safe haven. You're almost like you feel like family to them. It's gonna get me. And let me just, I'm gonna wipe all this sweat that's right there. <laughs> it's, like, it's kind of annoying. We have the Queen of Cups, which is Cancer. This person could be a sensitive water sign. If Cancer doesn't check out for your person, they're also falling under the Pisces and the Scorpions. If you look to her third eye, 
this person may have like naturally intuitive skills, even if they're not into tarot or they don't follow anything esoteric or, you know, vividly beautiful as far as like intuition serves. But I think that they purposely cover their third eye. You don't. This person does. Their feelings for you tonight, I will round it out as like the biggest major minor arcana is the Five of Cups, which is regret and remorse. I put this off to the side because I want to clarify it with the Ten of Swords. And they're also really, really sensitive behind closed doors. Their friends would never know that they're like this. Who, who am I connecting to? Because it seems like, can I see the cards for what's going on with Libra too? Can I, I want to do a quick check-in on you because we haven't done one since the ninth. Nine of Pentacles. Okay, Pentacles person. <laughs> From the recent, your video this morning had a lot of Pentacles on your side called out. So you have the nine and the seven here. I also have another one I can't see. Queen of Wands. Definitely. So she was the only card that I pulled in the pre-shuffle. I used the same deck. She was the only one that was there. Very, very attractive. People also wonder why you didn't end up with him. Like, I know I'm speaking to someone very specific tonight. I think that I'm connecting to you. The Queen of Wands, like even the, their family members are like, why didn't you end up with them? They were great for you. Um, they were well-spoken. They spoke clear. This person had clear goals that they wanted to do with their life. They had a vision that's coming to me. Okay, let's check out any more that you want to speak of for Libra. The Page of Swords. And I can't see one. The Fool. You're moving on. You've decided to duck out. The Eight of Cups in the earlier reading today could have been for you. That's what I'm seeing now. Page of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. You're popping out again. It, you've been coming out a lot on this channel as your very own, your court cards in Tarot. You've been coming out as air, which is really unique. It doesn't happen a lot. Besides this uh, Nine of Pentacles, you could have Earth in your chart too. Nine of Pentacles, she's hanging out alone, as you see in this spa, but it's a spa in the woods. So she's relaxing and she might be hidden in plain sight. You are a queen of... You're a queen of wands and a nine of pentacles. That's exactly how I see you daily on the channel. If anything changes in the future, I'm always going to be prompt and let you know. I'm very, very clear when I see energy change. Yeah, page of swords. This is going to be my new clarifier here. Eight of pentacles, six of pentacles. It goes in order. It's going six, seven, eight. They could be recalling certain times where they worked with you do you go and I'm, i mean i, f I kind of feel like this could also be the person you originally watched tarot for this could have been the person that spawned your awakening page of swords let's see what they're doing because this is a current card let's check that out can i see that page of swords please gemini libra aquarius the page of swords one of my favorite cards i get excited when i see the page of swords i don't know about you guys Thank you. Two. Can I get a third? Thank you so much, Justice. Someone's spying because they know they did you wrong. They'd like to, what I'm getting is it's a lot of amends fever. Like people want to make amends with you to the King of Wands. King of Wands, Ace of Cups. The truth is this person needed to love you right. Now they're living through, I'm looking at it as karma. You know, justice looks like karma. And someone could be dealing with that tonight, spying on you, also wondering why you're doing so great. Which you deserve. You know, that's what I want to add here is you deserved it. It's just not everybody saw it. And we also have the Six of Wands. Your revenge will be success. And I mean that in the nicest, quietest way. It's going to be your success. Let's clarify a couple cards. We're going to go back a lot of cancer in this reading. Cancerian male, Cancerian female, Page of Swords, you could be de dealing with Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Aries flipped over for some of you, that's who you could be dealing with, more air, 
a definite Leo from the past. I think this Leo, like I'm getting a really arrogant Leo. Okay, and justice too. You could be dealing with a Libra. You could be dealing with a Libra. Amen. And we also have the Eight of Swords. This person could be trapped by a living situation, um, income. Definitely a living situation is what I pick up. They could be living with roommates that make them uncomfortable, okay? Um, or a person that doesn't allow them to be themselves. And that's part of the karma too. You're involved in this because it's the way that they treated you. Justice. Page of Swords, please. I just want to coverage that minor arcana because it was in, if you looked, it was in our weekly read too. Leo, strength card. I think this is you. I don't think that they necessarily are touching onto their strengths. I think that they are matrixy right now or they're involved in the matrix world. I think you're the one that's the strong one. It's almost like you are the girl and you're also the whale in this tale of Moby D-I-C-K. <laughs> Everyone's gonna laugh at that. Oh no. But um, Page of Swords. So they're looking at you reaping the karma and rewards that you deserve especially if you're a libra your card's showing up too but you don't have to you could be any sign watching show me the queen of wands feelings five of wands all guys that are ready to fight it reminds me of gladiator 2 which doesn't look like it's going to do good at the box office because denzel washington is acting real modern in the gladiator 2 what else there's there could be other people that want you Libras and this person knows it. Ace of Swords. The truth is you are going to flourish either way with or without them. I'm going to get new cards for, um, let me move decks real quick please, just one second. Let me get cards for the company on Libra Light that has new people. Okay, so that looks like that was the original TF. Qu wow. On the grift. That was just grifting. For new people, they're very attracted to you, but they don't know what to do with you. Two of Pentacles is being mixed up. Split. Knight of Swords. Four of Wands. And the last one is the Sun. For new people, oh, okay. Justice is also here. A few cards away. A new person does want you, okay? And it's almost like they're going to be making an announcement of that through a date. So some of you are already in deep connection with a new person and they love you. They love them some Libra. They love your sauce. Let me get a card on that. Queen of Wands twice in this evening reading. The Queen of Wands, Six of Cups, and the Empress. That's an amazing way to end the reading tonight. I'm getting that cute song by Sabrina Carpenter called Espresso. I'm, I'm picking it up so vividly. This person finds you like a cup of espresso. You're like energy to them. Um, you're refreshing. You have a vitality that reminds them of a long time ago. Okay, this could go back to when they were children. Six of Cups can also be a very sweet card, not necessarily missing someone and burying your head in a pillow and crying over them. It can also mean that you have this new flavor towards them and a new soul contract because very rarely the Six of Cups goes back to being described as a soul contract. This person wants to start one with you. You're being viewed as highly attractive. I mean, look at the eyes there. Highly attractive. Why, what, how, how do they see Libra like this? Like it's taking my breath away. Justice, again, and it was also on the split. Libra energy, your skills are balanced. You look like Knight of Cups. This new person's all over you, like peanut butter and jelly. <laughs> I'm gonna go to part two. We will get some oracles to match this reading. I'll see you there.